Hi folks, today I'm going to show you how you can record your own mixed reality videos by using the newly released NVIDIA broadcast software and Lib. So if you don't know about the software, it was released yesterday on the official NVIDIA webpage and it's basically using AI and RTX powered cards to detect a subject in a video and for example, as you can see here, blur the background or even completely replace it. So what I'm going to do today is show you how you can replace the background with a plain color like green and then set up Lib so that it uses it as a virtual green screen and you can record your own gameplay uh, in virtual reality. So the first thing you're going to want to do is open up an uh, image editing program like paint.net over here. And what you can do is simply, you know, just fill a blank image with a color like green or depending on what you're wearing, you know, might choose something else something that is, is going to be um, you know, removed by Lib. Then you simply save this to some file like this green.png over here. And that's pretty much it for our virtual green screen. The next thing to do is setting it up in uh, NVIDIA Broadcast. So we just open the, the camera tab over here and we go to effect and we do background replacement. And in there we can use our green screen picture as you can see over here. And what happens is it tries to replace the background with the green screen. So you can already see a little bit of artifacts, especially if I move around, you can see some of the background popping in and out. So it has to be said that this is not perfect. It's not going to be 100% accurate, but depending on your camera, your angle, and you know what kind of things you're trying to achieve, it might be just good enough. And it's seriously, you know, beats having to set up multiple green screens in your room and having to deal with putting them up and down over and over again. So it is something you should try out at least to see if it works for you. So yeah, as you can see, it's definitely not bad at all, especially considering the lack of effort you have to put into it, into setting up your environment and, you know, just requiring space for the green screens and lighting and stuff like that. You can see in the video, sometimes my arms kind of disappear and sometimes you can see some green borders, but honestly, in a game like Beat Saber, it's not really a big deal. Another thing that I tried was using a different camera with a larger field of view, which would have like, um, you know, captured my entire body, but NVIDIA Broadcast just doesn't do well in that scenario and just kind of starts deleting my body as if it were part of the background. So I think you do need, um, you know, some perspective or field of view where your body takes a large part of the image and it's not just, you know, there in the middle with your full body. It has to be half your body or something like that. But, you know, if you figure out a way of making that work, that would be nice. Otherwise, we can leave the full body capture for the people with green skins and with the you know, desire of setting up the green screens every time. But this is a great solution. It's, you know, if you have an RTX card that supports it, super easy to set up, it works decently. So give it a try and let me know if that works for you. Cheers.